Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, let me introduce my colleagues because I'm not alone here, as you just said. Uh, Mr. Chabo Kakoshi, who is the uh, former Minister of uh, Economics, and now he's our, uh, how you, you said that, mastermind. Okay, so he's our mastermind behind our, our economic program. So he's the, 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 the guy who could be, uh, you know, playing uh, about the socialist part of the economic program if something is wrong with it. And the other colleague uh, is also a member of the socialist faction, Mr. Chaba Tod, who is responsible for the entrepreneur sector, particularly for the small and medium-sized enterprises. Because as far as I know, MCHAM, uh, in MCHAM you have big companies and, and the SME sector also represented. So, uh, so I think it could be interesting that what is our plan or what could be our plan for the future regarding the SME sector. So ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for the kind invitation. And uh, I try to be very short because always better to ask questions because then I'm quite sure that I will talk about the issues which are very important and interesting for you. And that's why I, I give you just a very, very short uh, uh, explanation of what we, what we are planning to do if we have the possibility in the next uh, period of time. Uh, first, just some words about uh, this current situation. Uh, our understanding is that in Hungary now there are three main crises. Around. The first one is a democratic political crisis, the second one is a social crisis, and the third one is an economic crisis. And that's why we we planning to deal with all the three uh, crises, so we cannot just pick one and uh, solve the problems of Hungary on the basis of that. Uh, we say that we have to do together and we have to use all the capabilities and programs and assets to, to manage and cope the challenges of the three uh, also. Uh, what we see, uh, especially in the economic uh, field, that the current government, non-orthodox economic policy, has not changed. So no matter how new persons are, or how many new persons are in the ministry, or who is the leader, who is the minister of the ministry, the economic policy is not changing because it's not based on Mr. Motochi, it was based on the Prime Minister, Mr. Orban. So it's, a, it's just a personal change, but not a, a content change regarding the government's economic policy. You see more and more new taxes, you see more and more austerity uh, measures and packages, and uh, we cannot expect that the government will change the direction of its uh, economic policy. What we suggest is absolutely different. We would like to focus much more on the economic growth. We would like to focus on the job creation. And uh, these kind of uh, programs are, are very much nowadays in line with what the European Union is uh, planning in the, in the future. Of course, to be able to, to, uh, to reach the economic growth or, or the job creation increasement, then definitely we need uh, investors. And definitely we have to uh, create an environment uh, which is uh, very much business friendly, which uh, welcomes the investors, no matter if it's uh, foreign or, or Hungarian investors. And definitely we have to create uh, predictability and uh, trust for the, for, the, for the government and its policies. That's why we, we uh, try to find innovative uh, solutions to, to create this uh, trust again in Hungary, because now what we noticed and what we experienced here in Hungary but wherever I'm traveling and, uh, and uh, negotiating with different uh, companies and, and experts, they say that Hungary is not now on the radar of the investors. And that's a big problem because to put back Hungary uh, on, the, on the radar, on the, on the map, it will be much more difficult than to take, uh, take Hungary uh, down or out of this uh, uh, prospect. So that's why we would like to create uh, uh, trust and predictability. And that's why, for example, just to name one, uh, I think, innovative uh, uh, action is like we are very much ready to have bilateral agreements with the investors, no matter Hungarian or foreign investors, just to ensure them that uh, the Hungarian legislative framework won't change, or if it, if it uh, changes, then of course we have the possibility to, for the arbitration, for example. So it's a bilateral contract between or agreement between the investor and the Hungarian state. And of course, it's not for the forever, but for the first two years, just to, just to create this uh, trust again between the investors and the Hungarian 
government and the political life, then definitely we need some stronger guarantees for the investors to, to come to Hungary and, and, uh, and create jobs and pay taxes, of course. So uh, that's why uh, we are in the first, if we have the possibility and if we get uh, uh, the chance from the people, voters, uh, from 2014, we definitely in the first two years we would like to concentrate very much on the economy because we believe that the first and most important thing that we have to restart the engines uh, of the economy. So that's why our program is very much focusing on, uh, on these issues and on our priority, on our agenda, uh, the, the economic issues uh, are the most uh, important uh, questions, definitely. So uh, just, just I wanted to give you just some, some, some interface that you can ask questions uh, on the basis of that. So uh, we are very much ready to, to answer the questions because uh, that's the most inter interesting part for me uh, in this uh, dialogue because then I can understand what are the main issues which are very important for, for uh, the investors and the companies uh, involved in the hardware business life. So thank you very much and uh, I would like to answer the question. There is no taboo, please answer very frankly and uh, strictly or directly, because I would like to answer the same, uh, these questions in the same manner. So please, the floor is yours. So ladies and gentlemen, we are ready for the questions, and Attila, it's always